Hi guys! Hi, happy Saturday. We are just off now for what is it? Lamination. Brow lamination. Brow lamination where they um wax tin and then I don't really know what they do. It's like it like sticks like the brows. Yeah. It's as if they're like fluffy, but you'll see. We just wanted this to show you. This is why we look hand. like completely so different. Look really like we've weird. Got absolutely nothing on our eyebrows. Yeah, but we're really excited. Can't so. wait to get them done. So we're going to take you in with us and try and film like as much as we possibly yeah. can. Um, and this is our before, and we'll show you what it looks like during and after. I'm just going to remove the product and the glue now, um, and then we're going to use what's called a setting lotion, which will just set all of the hairs in place. So that the way they're looking at the moment is that is this how they're going to look? Except towards the end, I sort of brush them down to give a more natural look. Because if right. I feel if they're all up, it's a very spiky brow, isn't it? Right. I don't think Em will want a very spiky brow, do you, Em? No. I look like they've been super glue. <laughs> they have, sort of. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just a wet one and then a dry one. How long does it last? The lift itself will last, similar to the lash lift, about six weeks. Oh, that's the good. Tin, as you know, is only going to be a couple of weeks, yeah. depending on how much product skin, you use. Isn't it? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, and it honestly does matter how much makeup you put on, how much you clean. And is it right that you thing. can't get them yeah. wet once you've had them dry? Twenty four hours, you need to keep them dry for yeah. So it's been on Emma's brows for about eight minutes. We're just on the second phase at the moment obviously they've not been waxed or tinted yet so they still look how they did before natural yeah yeah but once she's took this off and like puts the tint on you'll be able to see it so much better so with emily i'm going to use a light brown with a tiny bit of gray for the tint mm -hmm. and we're just gonna whack it all over don't worry about the shape at this point I love this tint. It looks like a taupe colour, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. I think if we go any darker than this, they're going to look too much, too much for Emily. Yeah, definitely. So I'm just dabbing the front so that we don't get a blocky brow look. Like, you know, that so full square at the front. Yeah. yeah no and then we'll leave the tails to develop a little bit more. They literally look like they've been coloured in. I can't wait to see what they look like. I can't wait for them to get be cut. They're gonna look so good. Guys, we just had them done. We are so happy with them, aren't we? They actually look amazing. Like the difference. It's so funny. We've got we will insert the clips. You've probably seen them before this. But it's so funny because you have to have like clean film over your face to put them up, but it's made them oh just like yours, them. like I, I love yours. Like because you're ginger like the color just looks absolutely yeah. amazing i'm so glad because i was like i always get worried if they're too dark yeah but yours looks so good as well and you can see like the actual hair marks it's so amazing they actually, and like considering we've just had them done like five minutes ago like I've they're had, hardly red either yeah. or like it didn't even hurt like i'm surprised like I hate going to some places where you have like blood marks, whatever. Like if they've yeah, cracked and they've like done it's it too hard much. and stuff like that. But I think the best thing about brow lamination is like they trap. They don't want to get rid of your hairs. Yeah. Like they work with the hairs that you've got, so they literally only get rid of like the top and the bottom. But it's so like natural as well. Like I know the tint isn't and that, but like it's so natural how they're brushed out. Yeah. And Emma, who did it for us, like she was absolutely amazing. She's so like cute. she made us feel. Like, so at home, yeah. like, she's got an introductory offer, which when you see this, that offer will be over. So she yeah. does them for £35, which is still amazing. absolutely amazing and cheap considering yeah. the research that we've done. And we figured... For like 50 or more. <laughs> Who's all staring at us? <laughs> like, people close to us have done them for like £50 yeah. and I, I wouldn't pay that. But seeing the results, <clears throat> like... Yeah. And definitely, we can't wait. To I think it's hard because, like, you want to pay what you think it's worth, and like, you don't want to go somewhere cheap. 
yeah. and not be happy with it but we are gonna tag it on our instagram anyway so you yeah. can have a look at her page if you're interested in any of that yeah definitely she's but, based in the north yeah. wales area but even if you're like not local Near. then definitely yeah. come and like get them done because it'll be worth it for sure yeah but we're gonna put up the before and afters yeah so excited so we'll insert um and yeah we're gonna go now because otherwise our parking will be up and i've got to take some parcels and that and then we're on our way to liverpool so yeah so we're gonna see one of the girls so we're gonna do a bit of like a vlog style Chatting. chat in the car we're yeah. not gonna do too much because we don't want it to be too long and then obviously when we get to liverpool we'll try and film a couple of bits there yeah. but we'll see you after when you went in i like looked to the left and the guy was like smiling at me and I was like I can't sit and speak to the camera I was like he's staring at me I literally was like um, I was like oh and she's just told me she wants to drink and I can't think about it it's alright I can drink this but then I looked at it and it's like you know thingy so I was like, like anything diet I thought it was then I can drink it and everyone drinks off, but I don't like for something I don't, I prefer, don't like it but I prefer diet coke yeah I do <coughs> but that was more expensive <laughs> On a budget, it was like two for whatever, two for two pound forty. For those, yeah, it's still expensive. I'm so excited for food. I nearly picked up snacks. Did ya? I was looking, cause I, but then I don't want chocolate. I'd want crisps. No, I'd want. I feel like savory, I can't snack yeah. crisps. I'm so excited. They do sushi as well, you know. I know. Did you see the sushi rolls? Rice they look rolls. so nice. Do you know? Um, have you ever heard of Gusto? You yeah. Know, boxes. Um, they have now Wagamama meals that you can oh. make. <gasps> oh my god! I know someone that's just ordered the boxes. Yeah. And um, they use sushi rice. You know, that's why you can't. You know, at home, oh, like yeah. it's not as nice. The rice. That's why, because they use sushi rice. I think as their rice. Don't quote me on it. It, it was in the box. They did like um, a dom. Is it a dom buri? Dom buri. Um, it's like a katsu curry, but not katsu. It was dom buri. I was gonna curry. say I see. Yeah. I I see. I'm trying to think who it was, but I seen someone and they said we made a wagamama at home, and I was like, I thought that they bought a takeaway yeah. and warmed it up, and I messaged her, and I was like. Oh. <coughs> So I messaged her and I was like, where did you get And she was like, no, no, I've got the Gusto box. And I was like, yeah. I wonder if I'd be able to have that though, because it is all fresh. I reckon so, because they had like the, um, they have all the things listed. Listed, And like, yeah. if you didn't want to put something in. I could probably in, go through it as well and check yeah. on the sin value, couldn't yeah. I? And just check. But to be fair, I think the only thing that would be sinned in something like that would be the chicken or the sauce. But they're quite good because they'll have like um skinless chicken or like um like the less fattier chicken yeah. and stuff like that because because it's they it's know that people are doing anyway, things like it? healthy and you know good stuff and they even do pork and stuff like that. That's nice in them. Mm. I'm not like a fan of pork usually, but it's so lean. Oh, we have pork in work all the time mm. when they make like little bow buns. They put pork I've in never it. had bao buns. That's why on this menu when it said bao buns, I was like, oh, oh my god. god. They're are completely they like... different on the menu than what we have. But if are I they? get if I get one in work, are they, are they like dim stuff? Like, no, it's completely different. Is it? I thought it was, and then when Charlie asked me, do they do dim sum at work? And I asked them, and they were like, no, no. If you want actual dim sum, go to Chinatown. Uh, and as soon as you get to Chinatown, like we're gonna be late, you know. So we've established we're going to be a little bit late. I literally <laughs> just panicked then because I forgot. It's only going to be like 10, 15 minutes. So we've just rang where we need to go. Um, and they've said, yeah, it's absolutely fine. Thanks for letting us know. We'll see you when you get here. Um, so when we get to Liverpool, we're going to park because it's absolutely peeing it down with rain. So we're going to try and park somewhere so that we don't like, get wet. Because we're, <laughs> we're not actually allowed to get our brows wet either. So <laughs> I did not know this. She <laughs> just told us how many hours? So basically it's tomorrow 20, morning 24 hours she um, like, and she was like you can't go anywhere and i was like are you joking it's what do you expect outside <laughs> she was like you're gonna have to get an umbrella to go <laughs> i'll literally be there and everyone's like what the hell are you doing it's funny
So guys, we just got back into the car. So we didn't, <laughs> we didn't vlog anything while we were yeah. out. It was a bit of a rush. We arrived at our table an hour late. I feel like we're not used to it as well. Like I'm used to putting stories up and up, but not Yeah, we did take some much. photos and we went yeah. to Dash in Liverpool and it was absolutely beautiful. It was really nice. It was like Asian, like Yeah, it was Chinese. like Thai it was food. Really, it had everything. We had, um, Katsu burgers, which was it like was so Wagamama's tasty. like dream. <laughs> yeah, if Wagamama did a yeah. burger, that would be like the burger that they would do. Yeah. Uh, for the three of us, it was a hundred pound, which was, you know, it was Not, yeah. it was ideal. We had yeah. starters, we mains, and we had drinks as well, yeah. so it was quite good. Um, we'll insert a couple of photos here because we did take some photos, but like I said, it was quite yeah. quiet. Yeah. Um, I think just it's brand new vlog, as well. We? Yeah. But then we've just been into town and they've now got a Morphe shop here. So we were like, oh my God, we need to go and have a look if the new Shane Dawson collection's there because we've both been watching the documentary. On YouTube. But yeah. they only had the lipsticks left. But I'm surprised they even had them left, to be honest. They didn't have um, they didn't have the red one left. No. They only had, um, they had Shane. They had the pink one. The like light was... pink the light pink one and the dark pink one yeah. and I really really wanted to see the red but the lady just said like you've got absolutely bob hope and no over picking anything yeah. up yeah and but she had the sample of the, the conspiracy, conspiracy one. Oh my, god. oh my god it looks so much nicer in real life like I actually think I'd buy it I yeah. thought there was too like when seeing it online I thought oh there's too many colors in there that like I wouldn't use but they look so much more like toned down like ones that you could actually like maybe and see, like you say stuff. seeing yeah. them like closer yeah like it looks so much more like versatile like the colors on the top oh my god they're so they're nice. like a nude color dream yeah when we seen it we seen all the imprints in it as well which was so cool yeah it but actually looks amazing in real life yeah obviously the palette that she showed us has been absolutely like used to death i can't everybody. believe like how much people have digged into it already <laughs> like i'd be horrified if that was my palette like some of them you can't even see the ingrains yeah, like, of like the tea mug and stuff like that but she did say like just to keep looking on beauty yeah. Bay, just to keep checking because she said like it's <clears> inevitable that it's going to be restocked again like it's, it's not like a one-time thing like it's a limited edition you will be able to get hold of it again but i'm glad i've seen it in yeah. real life because it's something i am definitely gonna buy and i think it would be really good if you go on a holiday or whatever because because of them like say a couple like there's a nice light purple in there and there's a nice greeny the blue yeah really nice. like there's stuff like that in there that when you're on holiday at night time you if you want to wear something a bit more out there or you've got a nicer outfit to go out it's absolutely brilliant because you've got your nudes for the and day and even if you wore like a white dress at night <clears throat> even just like a little bit of blue and yeah your eyes, make your eyes just and look that's absolutely silver beautiful. oh my god and we went to primark and there's a brand new i don't know if it's like they're going out christmas range i think it's their christmas collection their it's christmas so range. nice it's in their trend now bit um and we have got a video coming see in that yeah. later like this later yeah. next month of like a primal <clears throat> challenge and it just fits perfect with yeah, what we're gonna does. do doesn't it so we're just gonna go try find somewhere for dessert <sighs> yeah i'm really excited i really fancy something sweet yeah and um, the burger was absolutely beautiful but yeah. we had that probably about two and a half hours ago now and we've walked around a little bit so i think we're gonna go and get some food a little bit more food it sounds like this is all like, we've done in yeah. this vlog is eat <laughs> food but like there was actually no chocolate on the like dessert no, menu was, really we did ask to see the dessert menu and it was more it was it like was quite, alcohol infused yeah that, wasn't it? so it was like a porn star sorbet it's and then it was nice. sorbet and it was like meringue but it wasn't like your traditional like chocolate pudding so mm. i think that's what we're gonna go look for now and if we do find somewhere we'll try and remember to turn the camera on and take yeah. you with us.